It's pretty good fucking carrot. Um, all right, chickens will eat it. I think we're gonna change oil on this fucker tonight. Get it in the shop. Give it a going through. Because tomorrow I want to uh, put the fucking flail chopper in the shop. So because they're calling for rain Thursday, Friday. I want to get the flail chopper in there and start getting that thing gone through. We get the flail chopper gone through. Then we can work on the fucking uh We can work on the barge box. I gotta do a cylinder rebuild and everything on that fucking thing, so. Go check on cows here. These guys are up here fucking grouped up for some fucking reason. <laughs> uh, they must have partied hard last night. What'd you do? Be party a little hard last night, or the rest of ya? Hmm. That's getting a little suspicious. Everybody got a full belly and went and fucking laid down, or what? And you guys are out there giving her the shit. I haven't had anybody call me looking, telling me the restroom were over there, but that ain't all of them. I'm guessing they're out there somewhere there's some high spots out there where they might be fucking laying down or you might not eat well half of them you can't even see them in them fucking weeds yet fuck last night they got them in the weeds i didn't realize how tall they were the fucking cows disappeared in there in fact i can pretty i'm pretty sure i can see one laying down in there i can just see the fucking edge of his head pretty sure Oh well, they're uh, they're good anyway. Water trough is full. Everybody seems happy, and again, they're off of that part. They uh, they used that one up good, so um, I might put winter rye in that. Few bags of winter rye wouldn't probably be a bad idea. I gotta get a bunch from John when I get down there. I gotta fix that fucking fence there too. That's gotta get redone. Whatever. We always got something to do. So uh let's go get fucking things rearranged in the shop tonight and maybe I'll go dig that flail chopper out and put it out in front of the shop before we uh change oil in the tractor. I always she gets a little little heat in her we gotta clean out the fucking shop too so <laughs> it's a fucking mess but whatever i'll show you fuck it i don't care i'm not fancy pants and all that bloody bullshit so. <clears throat> let's get to it oh. i threw my beer cans and shit out too Start son of a bitch too. 4,577 hours. I think I was gonna go to 4,600 on uh, oil. It's close enough. I got the fucking time right now. We're gonna do it. So I'd rather be under than over, right? All right. So all this fence is coming out anyway. So what we're going to do is we're going to take it and uh, get rid of it right here. Okay. And then we'll uh, move these back. It's a drink, green drill I got from Tom Anderson. That's got to go in the shop yet too. That's not going to be operational this year. I need to get a whole pile of parts from Tom for it yet, but we'll make her. 
we'll make her happen. And then we're gonna finagle that fucking thing out of here. That one out of the grass. Oh yeah. Sure we can. Perfect. Okay, let's see how good my uh, operating skills are today. Don't count on anything spectacular, I'll tell you.
You recording? Hmm. All right, so we gotta clean some shit up around here anyway, but we're gonna start here. I went and got a fucking barrel. We got some waste oil that's from changing oil that's been sitting around in buckets and shit, so let's get that emptied out and we'll go from there. bit of grease and grime and that kind of shit in there but good to go use that for the tractor now um chunky we also got this one You gotta keep a constant pour on a five gallon bucket, or at least try to. Otherwise, you get it running back down the fucking side of the bucket. That was a band clamp from something. I don't remember what the hell that was from. Or you got dropped in there. Um, I think I got one more. Maybe not. I might taking that one to work. So what we'll do is when these get full, when that barrel gets full, we'll take it to work and evacuate it there. We use it for heating in the winter time. So by the time that thing's full, we should be midwinter at least. And we'll be in need of it at work anyway. So let's get to work on this thing. We'll get that oil dropped before we pull a plug. We want to come over here, pull that dipstick out like that. So that way that crankcase is sealed on this son bitch. Otherwise, she uh she'll start gurgling in your fucking this is 22 mil oh. socket. Nice and warm, runs nice. It's not too dark. Um, I'm not gonna pull the other side till this side gets most of the way done. It's not too bad for uh, diesel oil, 200 hours. I think that's where we're at. If I watched the video back, I'd know exactly how many, but from the last time we changed it, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna watch the video back, fuck it. Um, 7430 filter, Napa Gold. So round up one of those and we'll go from there. All right, so we got this second oh, drain plug. We got a pull here. It lets the uh, drive shaft run through the pan or underneath the pan. So there's two sumps on it. So you get a little bit more out of it. For uh, diesel oil, that's fancy power-driven diesel. Um, 1540 that Luke Strasser sent. For uh, diesel oil, that shit's pretty damn clean. Coming out of there. 
Luke, I appreciate you, man. Can't thank you enough. Um, that's some good stuff, I gotta say. We might uh, do a filter cut on it. I know Luke would like a filter cut. I don't have a filter cutter, but we can still cut the damn thing open, so. Um, we'll oblige. All right, it's a little difficult to get an actual filter wrench on this because of the harnesses. So I just use a, uh, and it's actually difficult to get the damn thing loose because you can't really grip it. So I just use channel locks. That works. I don't use channel locks to tighten it. I just man the fucking handle thing on there, but move our pants so we're in the right spot here. No, if I, I believe from watching my last from my last video, it's twelve quarts, three gallons. I believe. Here's that. I'll take that little schmutz off there. That was just from moving it around. So pour what we can out of it. Grab our new filter. 7430 once again. A little oil in that ring. things aren't bad to get to at all compared to some fucking tractors god damn right. you don't have to be super tight like I said you can't grip it so you can't get it you can't really over tighten it with your hands so Let's go cut this thing open and uh, that'll make Luke's day, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe not. He's into that shit, so we'll get it open. All right, since I don't have a fil actual filter cutter, I got a hacksaw. And we're just going to score the thing all the way around and pop the top off. It'll do. There we got it. Fucking mint. How much to see there? All right, let's grab some shop tools. All right, because I want some good light. Let me open this thing up so you can see. Now, everybody wants to get in there and be able to see what's in that filter. Let me get my hands clean here. Everybody gonna wanna know. Gonna wanna know. Is there any sign of particulates in it any copper any silver I can see a little dirt a little element 
nothing in the element though. I mean, I could rip it apart, fold out the pleats, but if there's anything majorly concerning, I'd, uh, you'd see it here. There's nothing that, uh, I don't know if I get, I'll get the light right, but nothing in there that concerns me. No major, no major particles of any sort. So, perfect. Fucking mint. Look in there. You can see the particles from cutting it. But you'd be able to see if, if there was something going on, you'd be able to see it in the element. Oil came, that came out of that element, so. There you go, Luke. I caught filter for you, bud. Maybe it works. I don't know. Fuck. I gotta... I gotta clean that off. I'll keep that one nice for fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. Actually, one of the garages I used to work at when I was in high school, one of my jobs was to cut filters because if he separated the metal and the element, he'd throw the element in the, his fucking trash disposal and then he'd throw the steel in the dumpster. I don't know. Whatever. I, I don't think it was legal, but it would... Or fucking roundabout. He took the elements home and burnt them, I'm pretty fucking sure. Whatever. Alright. Filter's on. Plugs are in. Dog needs a treat. Go outside. Thank you. And, uh... We gotta get some oil in that fucker yet, so let's get back to it. Alright. We got uh, three gallons of power driven diesel going in, courtesy of Luke Strasser. Lieutenant Commander, by the way. Uh -oh. Appreciate you, man. Power driven diesel for 1540 is probably some of the best stuff on the fucking planet. It's got all the good shit in it. You sure as hell don't want to have a leak on. <laughs> you don't want to be leaking too much of this shit out on the ground, I'll tell you what. I like to run them till I pretty much start dripping. I think you can get another half ounce out of the damn thing if you let it sit there and drip forever, but. There we go. Three gallons in. We'll get in here, we'll pull a dipstick, clean it off. Real good, real good. Throw that back in there. 
Yeah, we're right up in there now. Right in the middle. And she's pretty much a straight shot to the crankcase, so it's not like you gotta wait for it to run down. Yeah, you're right at the two on there, and I'm okay with that because oil expands a little bit when you're running, so I don't need to run it right at the fucking full line. I'm okay with it being an even three gallons to that point right there. Maybe some people aren't. I don't know. Could I put another quart in it and call it fucking 13 and go that way? Probably could. Am I going to? Probably not. Started and check for leaks and we're pretty much time for the premiere. And I'll bring it back after that. Ugh. So that's a good sign. Fucking me. <laughs> um, um, I'll tell you what. This year in particular, my uh, fucking hoarding of oil filters and shit, and that's only a little bit of what I got, but has paid off because you'll notice a lot of places... You know, for a lot of vehicles and equipment, you can't get fucking filters right now. There are certain filters we can't even get. Um, cows, we got fucking oil changed on the tractor, a little bit of everything in there. So throw me a thumbs up if you don't mind. Subscribe if you've made it this far. Memberships are down there. If you want one, and I do appreciate it. Members only videos on Wednesday. Ah, uh, fuck, we gotta do one of them for now. Yeah, we'll make it happen. Um, I got a bunch more maintenance on this. I wanted to get it out of here tonight. But we're going to do a bunch of other stuff just because it's fucking time. So we'll make her happen, Captain. But we're going to do it in another video. Hope everyone's having a great week so far. Tune in for the next fucking maintenance video. And we'll fucking see you on the next one.